Assalamu alaikum and hi to everyone. Thank you for watching this video. So in this video, I will show you on how to connect your Microsoft Access to your Visual Basic programming. So first step in this case, you need to uh, open your Microsoft Access and create a file. This one. Okay, so click on the blank database. You can name it as testing and create or well, testing already exists, uh, so I just put as a read it. So, this one is your table. So, in your first table of design view name your table as registration for this all so first field change why you can and add a uh, And you make your only and you have Okay, so this are the uh, field name or the column name and this one is the your data type okay, i make your username as the primary key so we cannot have the similar username and we cannot have the duplicate value of your username okay, done it uh once okay for example you can have zoo 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 password also do name zoo zoo you can have any data for example then we have the data Is easy. So this one is your uh, data inside your table registration. So you can save your data as. Make sure you choose X Microsoft Access two thousand two two thousand two thousand three format because we have we want to have the dot mdb. And then save as yes. So you can save at your desktop for this example. Now you can open your Microsoft Visual Studio. This one you can close first. Okay, you can click new project. 
use window form okay. test database import and create new okay this one okay now you have your first form you go to your data source click add new data source click on the database click on the data set click next and then new connection you make sure you choose microsoft access database so basically in microsoft access database we use only db database and browse your file name just now i save on the desktop so go for the desktop and click on the za 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 file so this is your uh, database and then you can test the connection okay, now test connection is succeeded then you can click ok and then click ok click on next button and yes next and okay, now you have both click on the both table and views and then click finish so your data set name is zazaza data set so under this one okay, you have the registration table so you can click on this registration table and then you have data grid a combo box list box and details you can click on details and drag to your form now at your form you have all the detail from your data set it is one based on your zazaza file and under the table registration we have username password full name phone number and phone address okay in okay, the next part on how to add the data screen at uh, this data set click on the registration table go for data grid view and drag form now you can have this kind of interface okay now you have details and you also have the data grid so you can just run start Uh, so these are the detail from your table registration number one number two three so when you click here you click here you can hold have those uh, data so basically this is how we connect from your application to your uh, database file so the next video i will teach you on how to create your first application maybe the login form so that's all thank you and assalamualaikum